everyone, my name is Zoe and welcome back to another video. For this video, I'm going to make something called button ring. And here's one I have right now. Me and my dad need it. So let's get started. What I'm going to do is show you guys what you need and how to make it. So let's get right to it. Bye bye. See that he's there. What you will need will be some elastic, some buttons, some thread, a needle, some scissors, and most importantly, a parent. I'm gonna tell you guys two reasons why you need a parent. The two reasons are because um, there is a needle and it's sharp, so you wanna be careful. The second reason is because you also might need some help and also you might accidentally be using your parents or your mom or your dad's buttons by accident. So you're going to need to ask them first and tell them what you're going to do. So that's why you need parent, a parent or two or a guardian. So let's just get started. So the first thing you're going to do is get some um, elastic. But before that, you have to set up a needle and some thread. So what you're gonna do is, you might want a parent to help you, or you could just do it by yourself. But be careful if you are. So what you're gonna do is easily just thread the needle. You also need to put a knot in the back. So that's what you're gonna do before you get the elastic. Then you're gonna get the elastic and get a parent or a guardian to measure your finger. And remember the elastic has to be a bit bigger than your finger and also leave some finger space to take it off. So maybe about that much finger, like that much extra space, then you're gonna have to cut it off. So that's what you're gonna do. Then what you're gonna do is sew the sides together and also have and, and then you just sew it in a loop. So that's what you're gonna do. Or your pen. Or your garden. Then once you're done with that, you you're going to get that and some more thread with the needle and stick it through that loop thing, the circle. Then you're gonna just sew, put it all the way through, and then get your first button, put it on, and you're gonna do that with the rest of your buttons. But remember, they have to be, they have to be good to actually sew through. And also remember that you can create your own. It doesn't matter how it looks or how it will be. So you can make it high, small, huge, big, tiny, teeny weeny. So yeah. Then you're gonna get the needle, put it down through, and then you're gonna just do that and then pull the needle through. So you're just gonna do it. Pull the, get the needle, put it up, and then put it down, and then you're going to have a parent, or you could do this, you're going to tie it off. So that's what you're gonna do. And then I'm gonna have my dad do this because I'm not really good at it. So here you go. So remember, it can't, it, it doesn't have to be as big as this, but I stayed with three. So there it is. That's how you make a button ring. I have two. All 
right, guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Remember to like, subscribe, and turn on notifications for more videos. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye!